Islam can be a very interesting and surprising religion to learn about. Much of what we uh, think we know about Islam is based on what we see in the news media, and that is uh, tends to be a rather distorted and certainly incomplete image of Islam. Um, what makes the news is the bad things uh, that are done by a select few individuals. The religion as a whole, um, over one billion Muslims, is much more moderate and tolerant than you might imagine. Islam is one of the younger religions of the world, uh, about 600 years younger than uh, Christianity, but surprisingly shares much in common with both Christianity and Judaism, and this I think is something that will become clear to you as you uh, proceed your, through your studies here. Islam is often thought of as an Eastern religion, and students are surprised to find that it's not part of a study on Eastern religions, but rather is grouped with Judaism and Christianity. And for good reason, Islam began in the Near East, like the other two religions, and it shares much in common philosophically with the other two religions. The same monotheism, the same God of Abraham, and um, the Quran, you may be surprised to discover, um, addresses many of the same people that and events that are discussed in the Bible. Islam actually has a lot to say about Jesus. Um, for them, he was a prophet, not the Son of God or the Messiah, but nonetheless, uh, he features very prominently as one of the most important of prophets, um, second only to Muhammad himself. There are probably more stereotypes and misconceptions about Islam than there is actual knowledge. So I hope that as you proceed through your studies here, you will ask uh, many interesting and curious questions and uh, actually do some research to find out what the real answers are. Um, for me, learning about Islam was more difficult than any of the other religions, uh, likely due to the preconceptions we have from our current events. Uh, but I have found that actually getting to know Muslims as people um, through my own encounters and dialogue has been the best way for me to really view Islam as a very worthy religion and one that certainly is nothing to be feared or um, attacked or um, thought of as other and strange. So um, I'll be interested to see how your perceptions of Islam change as you proceed through your study here.